Well, I think it's mainly positive news for the economy. <laughs> it shows it goes reasonably well and that the concerns of the, of the Fed are not too high, which is good. And by the way, this is what we see when I meet uh, clients in the corporate sector. They, they are reasonably positive. Uh, they invest, they prepare the future. Uh, of course, there are headwinds, trade negotiations, Brexit, uh, geopolitical tensions. But they invest, they prepare the future. So I, I understand that we are maybe in a, in a phase of stabilization of the economy. Yeah, we've just seen uh, today that the German economy avoided technical recession by more or less flatlining in terms of growth, and it's especially consumption which is holding up. So, um, would you say that doom of the uh, gloom and doom of the, the, the summer months, where everybody thought we are like on the brink of a recession, has been overdone, and we are now more or less in a cyclical recovery phase? Well, we shouldn't shift to over optimism. Huh? <laughs> we we need to be uh, reasonable. I think it's not as bad as what many people thought during the summer. Uh, consumption is key. Uh, fiscal policy will have a big impact in the future. Nobody knows what's going to happen. But when I look at France, uh, uh, fiscal support is, is, has an impact on the economy. We shall see what's going to happen in Europe, especially in Germany. Uh, this is to be, to be decided, but I'm not so pessimistic. Uh, what do you think uh, might come out of Germany? I mean, you must be very well connected there as well. So do you really think we're going to get fiscal stimulus? Because currently it doesn't really look like that. Well, I'm not so sure we should speak too much about fiscal uh, stimulus. We should look at the policy mix in Europe. What, what, what should be the policy mix? The ECB has moved forward a lot. They have done what they had to do. But they cannot be alone to do the job. And Mrs. Lagarde, as well as Mr. Draghi, had exactly the same view. So this is a call to governments to act. What should Europe do investing? It's not so much about consumption, it's about investment for the future, to prepare the future, technology, research, education. I hope the new commission will be focused on this, and I hope member states will support. Uh, let's talk about a bit also about the banking scene in Europe because you mentioned that the ECB has set rates into negative territory and a lot of banks are complaining very badly about the effect on their profitability. So how do you see that? Well, not easy, but our job is to adapt. A monetary policy shouldn't be designed for banks. Banks have to adapt, which is not easy once more, but we have to adapt. Uh, how do we adapt? business model. We need to have the appropriate business model in this environment. By product and by regions, uh, we need to reduce costs and we need to move more digital. So not easy, but our job is to adapt. The banking sector shouldn't be a toll on the economy, but a support to the economy. Hi, I'm Joanna Bersacci and thank you for watching. You can check out more of our videos by clicking on the boxes on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more from CNBC International. Thank you for watching.